Hi there, I hope you have a lovely day. Welcome to my channel. My name is Sona. So today I'm going to give you an update about the project It's Panning Cats and Dogs. This is a project created by Deb B as well as uh, Dennis Makeup and um, the premise of this um, project pen is actually you have your list of animals or pets and cats and dogs primarily I believe so and based on those prompts or you work your on your product so um, I do apologize if I sound a little bit incoherent because I am very very tired but I need to you know film some updates now so because next week is going to be very busy for me so now I actually printed out the list with the products uh, you know we have or the prompts we have 41 uh, prompts that we have to work on and you start with six so that's what I did now let's get started um, the first one that I had was best of breed tell us about your pet and I as you know I have a cat Fiona and she made an appearance last time a guest appearance and for that one I picked this little guy from Jcat Beauty this is the Love Struck Blusher and Bronzer in Kitten Kisses. I wanted to use it five times and as you can see I used it five times because the overspray or glitter overspray is almost gone. So this one rolls out. Then I had number two. Uh, Shih Tzu Multi, something small that has a big impact, pigment, highlighter, etc. And I picked actually this little pigment. I have not started working on it. I wanted to use it up, so therefore this one remains in the project. Then I had Labrador Golden Retriever. Hunting dogs, a product you had to hunt down, was hard to find. And I told you guys, I think, um, several times already that I had some difficulties in, back in the UK to find some American products because they were not ready or not available in stores. Now it has changed, of course. We have a lot of, or back now, when I visit the UK, I can see there are lots of you know products in boots and so on. So there you go. Now I have this little guy here, the putty primer from ELF and I wanted to use it up. As you can see here, there's a big dip going on. But by the way, I noticed something. I don't know if you have ever seen this little guy from Urban Decay. This is the Optical Illusion Primer. It is literally the same product. Uh, because you know same consistency same feeling on the skin and i believe if you had you know if urban decay would have kept this product instead of discontinuing it you know they would have made big money because elf now uh use uses this formula you know i don't know because they are producing it in china maybe urban decay had uh, the rights to this product before and they you know sold it under this name and then it was kind of because they discontinued it, they had lost the rights, and then this company who sells or who produces actually this uh, putty primer, you know, concoction, how you want to call it, uh, they just sold it then to Elf, and then Elf made a big money off of it. You know what I mean? It's like, uh, because some people compare it to the Tatcha, a silk canvas uh, primer, and so on. So, but it's literally the same product. It is. It is in in fact I believe the same product. You know I've not compared the ingredients, but the feeling, the touch, it is the same. I mean I can I can just say you know this one was a putty primer long long before this one came out. So there you go. Now then I had uh, in CME's loudest purse product that makes you purr with delight. As you know I love blushes. I have a big blush collection and I'm going to make a separate video about blushes that I really want to pit pan on or use up actually if I can. That's another story. And I had here this Makeup uh, Academy blush in Bittersweet and I wanted to use it five times and I used it five times. So there you go. This one rolls out as well. So two blushes out of this project. I don't know why I put in two blushes but there you go. Then number uh, seven, German Shepherd Guard Dog Protect an item that protects your makeup, uh, um, SPF primer, setting spray, powder, etc. And I picked actually this little guy from Essence. The pump on it, the spray on it is amazing. The finest mist that you can get. And I wanted to use it 10 times. I've used this one so far, I believe, um, six times. So this is the You Better Work uh, Gym Proof Fixing Spray love this guy i mean i will reuse a bottle until it breaks with other products but i want to use uh, this one up and then just use keep the bottle then 
uh, number 17 Sharpe skincare product that combats wrinkles and you know I have here this AHA 30% plus BHA 2% peeling solution from the ordinary I used this one only one time I wanted to use it actually five times so this one remains in the project uh, so then what else did I have I have did I have one more no that was it okay that was it as I have two rollouts I need to get in now two new products so let me put in the number in my pretty random app then just so so number 41 and let's see what I can do number 30 36 so number 37 36 and 37 so let me mark first on my sheet of paper what it is ex exactly so number 36 scratching posts any nail product polish okay any nail product that polish cuticle oil etc that's fine okay so then number 37 dalmatian use any product 101 times or use an item with black and white packaging Okay, black and white packaging, that's doable. So, then I see you in a bit and I will bring out the product that I want to use. So, I am back with the products that I have picked for the prompts 36 as well as 37. 36 was scratching post and in a product and I picked here this little guy from Sally Hansen. This is the Smooth Perfect Color Care uh, Nail Polish in the shade Whisper can see it this way yes whisper and I picked actually uh, for now the prompt 37 Dalmatian use any product 101 times or use an item with black and white packaging I thought about this little guy from Kat Van D now it's called KVD and this is a locket lever uh, not lever feather feather weight primer base and it's new you know so it's kind of old of course but it is what it is let's use this one or these two guys here five times each and then roll them out so that was my little update for the project it's panning cats and dogs i hope you enjoyed it i see you in the next update have a good day bye bye